Your materials probably look like this, or they look like this. But why is it like that? Well, it's, it's very simple. It's something that the game doesn't actually tell you very upfront. So when you're playing Diablo and you're going through the world, you, you see these veins and you pick those up, right? And you're thinking, hey, a majority of my ores are going to come from this. Bruh. Wrong. Wait, what? What the game really doesn't tell you is that your ores actually come from salvaging weapons and hides come from salvaging armor. Not only do ores come from weapons, they also come from ring and accessories as well. And a good rule of thumb is if you look at what materials an item requires to upgrade, then you can see that those are also the material that item also salvages into. All right, so this segment, I'm just dismantling. So all my armors, right? I'm gonna just do my armors first. And look, look, it's just hide. It's just hides. It's just hide, hides. Now if you disenchant rings, you get ores. You get look. That was a rare ring, and I got a silver ore and an iron chunk. All right, it's meant a weapon. Ore, ore, weapon, weapon, ring. It's an it's another ore. Weapon, weapon, weapon. Hey, that's pretty good. So that weapon gave two silver ore. Crystal sigil. Ore. And then this last one, also ward. I kind of want to keep this. Yeah, I'm going to roll the crowd duration. But yeah, so it doesn't say anywhere in the game, but look. If you read it, it just says, can be used for improving armor, which is true. If you go and you upgrade weapons, like, that's what you use to upgrade. But little, it doesn't say anywhere that weapons dismantle into those specific things. So if you're if you have a surplus of one thing and you're re realizing hey I'm running out of inventory spaces or whatnot, then yeah this is what you can do. You can just look for weapons and weapons and rings. Amulets too. And basically dismantle those. So as a rule of thumb, if you forget, just think of what your item requires to upgrade. So if, and then that's that's kind of what um what it can dismantle into really. Which is really weird that it doesn't say on here that you can get it from the, from salvaging. But yeah. The dismantling session, so armor. This is also armor. So, armor. Three ranks of death blow. And armor. Go down life, save it, armor. Armor. So all hides. And now I do weapon, weapon, weapon. So all ores. So hopefully you found this video helpful. But what you can do with this information is you don't have to stop what you're farming or what you're doing and go out in the world to get ore or whatever. You can actually just keep farming what you're doing and just pick up weapons if you're lacking ore and pick up armor if you're lacking hides. That way you can keep grinding away at those nightmare dungeons and just do whatever you want to do. You know, play the parts of the game that you like. I'm starting to make more Diablo 4 content, so if, if you guys like what I'm doing, I have a couple ideas for series that are coming out as well. I'm super excited. Thanks so much for the support um, on that Whirlwind Fury video. Like, I, I was not expecting it to pop off. Um, I'm a very small channel. Uh, I've... I, came over from Walsark and I, I could not stop playing Diablo 4. I, 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 it takes it takes a bit of time to make the videos, but I, I think it's a lot of fun and I, I appreciate you guys stopping by. I'll, maybe I'll see you guys on stream. <laughs> Take it easy.